Mary, I'm sorry. I'm coming home a day late. Gotta make a detour. What? Again? Your boss always does this to you. I'm sorry. I know it's not easy being alone while pregnant. I'll be back in two days. You feeling okay? Everything good? Yeah, I'm feeling good. I'm five months in now. I'm actually eating a lot. Doctor said I could start exercising a bit if I want. Sometimes I go to the park for a short walk. Cool! How are your parents? Hope they're doing well. Yep, they're really excited about the baby. I've never seen them so excited. They already started buying clothes for the baby. I'm only five months in. <laughs> oh, I see. Tell them I said thank you. I'll get them something nice on the way home. No worries. They're just really excited, that's all. No need to get them anything special, okay? Okay. Take care, okay? Stay warm. Yeah, I know. Thanks. Come home soon. Of course. By the way, where are you right now? You outside? Huh? Why? I'm at my parents' house. Oh, what a coincidence! I'm here too! What? Uh, what do you mean? What do you think it means? I'm right in front of the house! Your parents are actually right in front of me! Wait, what? Uh, I thought you weren't coming home for two more days. You said... You lied to me? Well, technically no. I'm spending a few nights here, so I won't be home for a while. So tell me, where are you? I don't see you. Oh, uh, I'm at the convenience store, yeah. Be home in a bit. You sure? You're at a hot spring resort, aren't you? What? How did you... Look, I know everything. I know you've been cheating on me. Uh... He's your ex from college. It's been going on for a few months now, right? And I had to go away for a while for work. So you decided to go on vacation with him, right? Oh, and you lied to your parents, too. You told them you'd be staying at home, right? By the way, your parents are reading this, too, as we speak. You just can't stop lying, can you? They seem really upset. Your dad looks pissed. Your mom is crying. Hold on. Look, it's not like that. I'm just with my friends. My ex is here, too, but... I'm not cheating on you. So why did you just tell us that you were going on vacation? You lied to all of us! Well, uh, cause I was pregnant. I thought you'd say no. So, yeah, that's why I didn't tell you guys. You gotta believe me. I know you're lying. Huh? I know it's just you and him. I hired a private investigator. He's been following you for a while now. It wasn't cheap, but it was worth every dime. What? What are you saying? Pictures, texts, I even got some videos. I printed it all out. I showed it to your parents too. I got more than enough evidence. Stop! Why would you do that? Why get my parents involved? You think I wanted to do this? It hurts me too, but I had to be sure, you know? What do you mean? The baby. Is it even mine? What? I did the math. I think there's a high chance that it's not mine. Five months ago, you were spending a lot of time with this guy, so... What do you think, Mary? What? Stop saying that, Bob! How dare you! So this is my fault now? Whatever, here's the deal. I'm divorcing you. I'm gonna sue you both for damages. What? No! And I want a DNA test for the baby. If it's not mine, I'm not paying child support. You'll be fine, though. You got your boyfriend. Wait, I can't marry him. He's, um... He doesn't have a job at the moment. Oh, that sounds fun. He got fired for embezzlement, right? How did you... I know everything. And after he lost his job, he's been living in your old apartment. And I know you've been stealing money from your parents to look after him. And that you used the money to pay for your vacation. It's over. We're done. No, please, I'm sorry. I just felt really bad for him, and... I just wanted to help. I never meant to cheat on you. Please, forgive me. I can't marry him. I can't take care of the baby on my own. And I can't ask my parents for help either. Please, just give me one more chance. I'll do anything. What? You serious? You already had your chance to come clean, and you blew it. All you do is lie and make excuses. I'm sick of this. 
I don't care what happens to you. Go to hell! I'm not raising some other guy's kid! And you're gonna pay me back for all the money I spent on you! No, please, please! I swear this will never happen again! The baby might be his, but... The kid has nothing to do with this! So please... Now you're trying to use the kid as an excuse? You're unbelievable! The baby isn't mine! I'm done with all of this! You said you'll do anything, right? Fine. Get the hell out of my life and never come back! No, please! I... I was lonely! Ever since I became a housewife, I lost touch with my old friends and... You're always away on work, so... I just got bored and I was lonely, okay? What? You're the one that said you wanted to quit your job. I tried to stop you, but you said it would be fine. You didn't even listen to me. And you lost touch with your old friends because you were a jerk to them. You thought you were better than them because you didn't have to work for a living, right? What? Who told you that? Your old friends told me. They were really annoyed by you. They said you changed after you got married. And about my business trip, I know I'm barely home and I feel bad about that. So after I got married, I asked my boss to keep them as short as possible, so I could be home with you. But I guess you didn't know that. You chose to be a housewife. Nobody forced you to do that. It doesn't give you the excuse to cheat on me! Stop, stop! Just stop, okay? I was really stressed out, okay? I just had to vent! And what about you, huh? Who knows what you're really up to on these business trips? Yeah, why am I the bad guy here? You're insane! If you're gonna accuse me of things, get some proof first! You won't get any though, cause I haven't done anything wrong. Whatever. Just don't contact me again! If you've got something to say, contact my lawyer! No more direct contact! I'm gonna change the lock on the house, so don't come back! You're free to go! Wait, no! We gotta talk about this! Come on, don't be like that! I don't wanna see you! Ever! I already told my lawyer everything I wanted, so I guess you get a lawyer too! With what money? I don't have any money! That's not my problem! I'll email you my lawyer's contact info tomorrow. I'm going to sleep. Good night! No! Wait, Bob! Wait! Wait! After that, I divorced her and sued them both for damages. I never had to see her once, and I got a huge cash settlement. They did a DNA test on the baby. It wasn't mine. No surprises there. I heard Mary broke up with her boyfriend. She left her kid with her parents and ran off somewhere. Her older brother and his wife ended up adopting the kid. Thank you for watching. Please subscribe and hit the like button. See you next time.